depending on your school, there are very there may be various web blocks. Um, quite often, there are good reasons as far as for why they put school web blocks up. Sometimes it's just a matter of that they want to save bandwidth to block it, and occasionally they will be blocking traffic that's to bad websites. You can find some things that you may get emails that say, oh, go to this website, and it may actually be a phishing scam, a virus, something along that line. And if they've blocked the website, then that will prevent you from downloading the bad program, which may infect your program and send spam messages out to everybody that you know in your email address book. So be careful about bypassing some of the web blocks because they may be there for a good reason. Now, if you're fairly certain that it is an actual valid site, you can find, as far as for some of the people at your school, maybe they know of a way around it, but that is going to be very dependent on where you're at and how and what blocking software they have at that point.